What's up everybody, welcome back to yet another video. Today I'm starting a road trip with my best friend in Kilkis, Greece. And I'll take you with me in this experience. I just packed my luggages and I'm about to leave. Of course I'll take the camera with me, but I will mostly vlog with my iPhone. We will also go to some beaches and maybe in Thessaloniki. I think this is going to be a very nice experience. Now let's see what I have in my bag for this trip. Here is my mouse, cables, power bank, adapters and cables, and the MacBook. On the other side of the bag I have my camera, two lenses, an external drive 1TB, Gorillapod, a brush for the dust, extra battery with the charger, and some extra batteries for the flash. I also have this adapter for the wall. Okay, that's what I have in my bag and now let's start. A person who thinks all the time has nothing to think about except thoughts. So, he loses touch with reality and lives in a world of illusions. By thoughts I mean specifically chatter in the skull, perpetual and compulsive repetition of words, of reckoning and calculating. I'm not saying that thinking is bad. Like everything else is useful in moderation a good servant but a bad master and all so-called civilized peoples have increasingly become crazy and self-destructive because through excessive thinking they have lost touch with reality that's to say we confuse science with the real world I'm in the second day here in Kilkis and I just came back from the stadium that we playing football with friends. As you can see I'm very dry but I will take a shower. Okay, bye for now. Most of us would have rather money than tangible wealth and a great occasion is somehow spoiled for us unless photographed and to read about it the next day in the newspaper is oddly more fun for us than the original event this is a disaster for as a result of confusing the real world of nature with mere signs, we are destroying nature. We are so tied up in our minds that we've lost our senses. Time to wake up. What is reality? Obviously, no one can say because it isn't words. It isn't material, that's just an idea. Reality is... Third day here in Kilkis and I'm sitting in the sunset as you can see. And maybe tonight uh, we will go to Thessaloniki and stay there all the night. 
I will also go to Kilkis now for coffee or something else with my friend. Today all day we were sitting, we were playing PlayStation and just chilling in the village. In front of me I have some storks, as uh, you can see. It's so beautiful, I have took some photos of them. Now you can see them. So beautiful animals. Stay tuned for the next update for this trip. One must live. We need to survive. To go on. We must go on. I just came back from Kilkis that we went uh, for a cocktail and for a souvlaki. It's about uh, 12 o'clock and uh, in, uh, in about 2 we will go to Thessaloniki uh, to a friend. Uh, we will stay there for uh, like uh, 2 days. Okay, bye for now. I just came back from Thessaloniki that uh, we went. We took a luxury uh, minibus to go to a very famous church in Veria. We saw the church and we stay here to eat. The food was pretty good and we are about to leave to go back in Kilkis. That's the bus as you can see, it's very beautiful and I love it. Thank you.
These two days in Thessaloniki we did a bunch of very interesting things. Firstly we went for a coffee and uh, after we did some window shopping in a very famous street in uh, Chemiski. Then uh, we went to a very famous uh, restaurant Sta Gala Gathumena that we ate. Uh, the food was pretty good and I wish one day I will go again. Then we went for a chili cocktail at uh, Evosmo. Then we tried uh, to go to a very famous uh, bar the Manhattan but it was full. We slept in our friend house and then we start the trip to Kilkis. Tonight is the last night here and we are going to go to the city center for a chili cocktail or something else. Last day here uh, in Kilkis. It's 8 in the morning, and in about 2 or 3 hours uh, we will uh, leave uh, for the Thessaloniki airport. I just uh, check in my tickets, and unfortunately, I'm not sitting at the uh, window.
back here in Athens. It was a very nice experience. One day I wish I will do it again. And that's the video. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.